and we live what's up family what's up family as y'all come on and jump in my guy our youtube family facebook family linkedin family for you instagram family uh, should be, just, just right. jumped on should be popping over what's going on everybody yes so again your first time jumping on my name is byron i'm Sharnice, and together we're the mobile home elite investors so welcome to our YouTube channel, we lit, right? Yes. <laughs> we about to turn up tonight. We got one of our great fast track students coming on to talk about her journey. I ain't gonna say too much because I'm gonna let her hop in and talk about her own journey, but I'm super excited to hear it too. Yeah, no, I'm super excited, y'all. So I love it. I see we got some first timers. What's up, Sophia? How you doing, Sophia? What's going on? But y'all know, listen, before we even get started, man, you know what? I forget, babe. We, we used to have a nice intro. We're gonna give y'all a quick little snap of our intro. We can't, we're not, you know, we can't even start without the intro. So we're gonna go get the party started right. definitely had to add that in here but before so, go ahead i was like what's up demetrius from south carolina yes so listen do us a favor right before we go ahead and get this thing kicked off first and foremost i want you to make sure you if you have not subscribe to the youtube channel all right mh elite investors facebook make sure you like and share and then i want y'all to share this live with at least three to five people because i'm telling y'all it's gonna be very special and the beautiful thing about it is gonna be a replay all right, so before we, we start warming it up, let me see where y'all checking in from. We see Demetrius was checking in from South Carolina. Let me see where y'all checking in from. Go ahead and drop that in the chat where you're checking in from. We checking in from Chicago. Oh, I love this, man. Yes, and Kia said, yes, supporting my, yes, Elite Squad 5, Sister Roberta. We got the family in the house. Shout out Elite Squad 5. What's up, Katara? She and our new Elite Squad January class came through last night. Let's get it. Let's get it. We got Charlotte in the house. Virginia. Virginia. We got Texas. Man, shout out Keelan. What's that, Elite Squad? Is that four? four. Man, four. okay. Cedar Rapids, Iowa. What up, Ariel? Okay, Charles, another fast track coming to the January class. Oh, man, DMV in the house. We got PA, okay. We got Pennsylvania, South Carolina. Carolina. Over, what's going on? Checking in from Shot Town, okay. What's going on? ATL, okay. Man, Kendra, what up? What up? Okay, Elite Squad, okay. Let's get it. Let's get it, man. Listen. So before we bring this queen up, I need y'all to warm it up, man. I need y'all <laughs> to warm it up. I need y'all to drop those fire emojis. Because I'm telling y'all, if some of y'all may have caught it, we, we, we brought it on the IG live before, but <laughs> I cannot wait to y'all hear her story. I need y'all to start dropping those fire emojis because we got to make sure the queen is warmed up before she hit the stage, before she can even, you know what I'm saying, grace, grace y'all with her presence. We need y'all to hit them fire emojis. Okay, let's see. Opal got it started. Let's see. Let's go ahead and fire it up for us. Let me see them fire emojis so we can make sure we get the queen started. Oh, man, we got <laughs> Charles, man. Yeah, they ready. They ready. ready. So without further ado, I want to introduce this queen hailing from Georgia, who was in our elite squad number five. <laughs> uh, he be looking at me. I, like, I had to make sure, but just for confirmation. <laughs> he right? looked dead at me like, you're right, five. <laughs> <laughs> all right. But, you know, again, she's killing it. Uh, man, she literally, you know, story is phenomenal. We're going di to dive right into it. But y'all, I want y'all to give it up for a miss. Roberta, what's going on, Roberta? Hey, everybody! Hello, new oh, all of us. Let's get hey. it. How are you? I love it. I love it. You see, they warming it up for you. They excited. They ready. You know what I'm saying? So, yes, yes. man, you want to want to get right into it, babe? Yes. Yeah, so, Roberta, like Byron, you know, we know we know a little bit about you, but I know we got some people out there like, who is Roberta, right? So. 
give us a brief intro of who you are. Like, do you work right now? Are you a full time investor? Um, so currently I do still work in the corporate world and I'm a realtor. I'm licensed in Georgia and Alabama. Um, and I'm a mom also. So, and then I've kind of taken this new adventure on and full speed ahead, full speed ahead. So, wow, no, that's so cool. That's so cool. So I love it because first time she said like, you know, full time, like, honestly, I love thinking about it. You said in the corporate world also. Mm -hmm. A realtor and a full-time mom, y'all. So everybody on here, y'all, yeah. First thing I want y'all to listen to is no excuses. Right. <laughs> uh, triple threat. You got a lot going on, and you still yeah. making time to get in these streets and get these mobile homes. So yeah, absolutely, it. absolutely. It's there, so why not? You know, mm -hmm. it's there, so let's let's do it. Let's do it. I love it. So added a fourth to it, a new baby called mobile home investing. Yes, yes, that's my new baby. That's what I'm nurturing right now. You know, I'm hey. right now, baby. <laughs> I love it. So, Alberta, let's talk about the first deal. The first, the first deal, right? Because you know, again, we we gonna talk about it, but let's talk about you know, you 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 sign up for the fast track, mm -hmm. right? You're in week what? Oh, go ahead, babe. No, I was going to say, so I want everybody to get a timeline of this, right? Because, Roberta, you was in our squad five. So yes. you guys technically just graduated, right? So that Yes. Was November 5th. Yeah, November 5th, <laughs> right? November 5th. And we started yeah. the program in the beginning of October. So I want mm -hmm. everybody to understand that, again, Roberta's only been with us for about a little bit over a month. Mm -hmm. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> yeah. So... You end up getting a deal in which week? And talk about that. So technically, right before class started, I um, DM Nicole and was like, so we're talking to some park owners and I want to kind of go through it. And she was like, you better wait to class. So mm -hmm. I waited and then the park owner called again and I was just okay, you know, I'll come out so forth. Um, and then finally, Although she told me no, I just was like, okay, forget it. I'm jumping off the porch and <laughs> voila, Byron Charnese, y'all seen the picture. Y'all said no. Everybody said no, but. I said hell no, but <laughs> I was like, absolutely not. But again, you had a plan. We gonna get, I know you're going to get into it, but yeah. yeah. I did. I did have a plan. Um, I mean, you know, what they say, no risk, no gain, no reward. Yes. And I just was like, it's there. I saw the bigger picture. I saw the vision and I just did it. And Nicole was yeah. like, are you crazy? <laughs> <laughs> I love it. I lo so talk about, okay, so you got, so you got the house. So talk about how many houses did you get and for how much? I got three houses. Ooh. I was, yeah, three. Um Ooh. And it, I was like at 1875. Yeah. For a, all three, not per the package. 1875. So we're talking about $1,875. Yes, for three. For uh, three mobile homes, three assets. I hope y'all listen to this. Right. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so they can understand. Three mobile homes yes. for $1,875. Yes. So I'm gonna ask, so we, we need the we need the audience to learn too, right? Because we talked about it. So for one, I'm gonna ask you your houses. You remember on the course we talked about the grading scale, right? Yeah. A B C. What what grade was your houses? It don't have a scale. <laughs> 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 um, I can't really. <sighs> so I guess to be fair, um, honestly, they don't have a scale. I do have walls on two of them. One of them did not. <laughs> <laughs> I did have a sunroom as one of my E5 sisters <laughs> called it because half the roof was missing. But hey, I had walls, so we were good. Um. So yeah, I can't even honestly. I don't think it was a scale. I think yeah, it wasn't. <laughs> it so, was not. Much, so 
So pretty much these were some mobile homes that needed a lot of work, needed yes. a lot of rehab. So talk about your exit strategy with these homes. I know you're in the process now of rehabbing them, but what do you plan to do? Are you moving them? Are you keeping them in the park? Are you going to flip them, do some rents of owns? What's your strategy? Um, so with all three, one of them will be, honestly, I have a lady um, that lives in the park and she wants to purchase it for her daughter already. Um, so right. one of them will actually be sold as soon as it's done. Um, okay, look, hold on. We got to clap it up. Wait, I need to clap it up for that. Hold on. Yeah. Hold, on. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. You said that's so, so, so easily, right? So, it's like, so elegantly. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> she said, I want y'all to listen. To, I got to put the gym sign up because it's sold before it's already finished. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's sold before it's already finished. Um. And just from being in the park, I go to the park every day, every day. I just had foot surgery and I was in the park yesterday with my boot on and my crutches. I had the handyman helping me up the steps to look at some more. <laughs> so, I love it. Um, but to answer the initial question, yes. So that one will be sold. Um, I plan to either rent to own, um, but I'm doing requiring kind of a large down payment. So okay. and just continue to flip and keep going from there so i love it wow, i love it, I love <laughs> so, it. Now, yeah. let's see roberta what i love about it again like you know I'm, i gotta go back to this donnell said she said it's so nonchalantly right like it's <laughs> right. Before, it's, yeah, before. She's like, i mean so i have somebody in the park their daughter and yeah they're gonna buy the house when it's done you said it so calmly like that's a huge <laughs> deal that yeah. is a big deal because the number one thing that people are worried about in getting in mobile home investing are are they going to find buyers right who are the buyers going to be and you were again and again you got the background you're a realtor so you mm -hmm. got to know how to talk that talk and negotiate so again you seen some people in the park already building those relationships and they see what you're doing hey you can buy this mobile home for your daughter Look at it. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. And honestly, um, I did. I, I don't do vinyl siding on my mobile homes, but that's just me. Um, I do hardy board um, and hardy board was being put up and she drove by and was like, I love this. It honestly makes it look like a home and not a trailer. Mm -hmm. um, and so I was like, yeah, you know. I just wanted it to kind of look a little different and give that special little vibe for so yeah. it's not so much a mobile home per se. Mm -hmm. um, and she was just like, I love it. How much does it cost? And I was just like, I mean, sure, if you want to buy it, mm -hmm. you can talk to my contractor and see. And she got out of the car. Her daughter was there and she was like, I really love this. Um, and I want my daughter to move to the park. And she was like, so are all of these yours? And I was like, yeah, they're all mine. And she's just like, well, can we walk them? I mean, it's a construction zone, but sure, you know. Right. <laughs> was like, at this point, they're all gutted. The outsides are done. We got doors, windows. The full outside is all done, um, but the inside is still gutted and things. Um, and she couldn't envision it. We kind of talked about it, and she was, oh, well, yeah, we want to do this one. Um, she has money coming from a lawsuit that she got, and she wanted to buy her daughter a home. Nice. Appreciate it. Right. I <laughs> like, love yeah. it. So yeah. that one kind of got sold already. Um, <laughs> but then I still get a lot of interest from people just kind of coming through the park and then me still talking to people. Um, I talk constantly about it now. So anybody, nice. are you picking up a piece of sheet metal? What you doing with that metal? <laughs> <laughs> so, and that, that helps a lot though. I love it. So when I... When is that one set to be finished for like, um, to purchase it and everything? Um, the 30th, November right. 30th. Right. Okay. Yeah. So a good early Christmas present for them. I love it. So <laughs> this so real so what I love I want to rewind a little bit because we gonna sure. I know we're gonna talk about some wins, but we we kind of went briefly though, but I know Roberta talked about she said, you know, that home, I don't even think it is a great, right? And I'll be honest, when Nicole showed us. We was like, oh, 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 I don't know about this one, right? And normally, I was like, she need to wait to class. Yeah. <laughs> and normally, the reason we always say that is because we always want our students to, you know, again, have a basically a not a hard path, but, you know, be able to kind of get something. And what I like about it, Robert, Roberta went against status quo and was just like, I'm buying these. Mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. I, I don't care that they look the way what y'all said. I get it. I don't it. care what y'all said. This is my vision. I got it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and so, you know, when you so let's let's talk, let's let's be open and transparent, Roberta. Like, you know, you talked about, you know, buying these homes for that price. Mm -hmm. But for three homes, what, what were you quoted for renovations? Uh 35 for all three. So 35,000. Yeah. 35,000. Um, I did have a wall once we fixed the roof that had to be repaired, which is an extra 1500. Mm -hmm. Um, but I did kind of put cushions. So I've estimated out 40 just in case for, you know, those, those little things like that. Um, but so 40 is kind of set aside for all three total. Right. So. Mm -hmm. so 40. So think about this. I, I hope y'all listening. Right. She said, Oh, excuse me. Right. So 40. So you're talking about, again, 40,000. And that's and that's really including your, your your cost that you paid for them. Right. Yeah. That's 40, mm -hmm. And again, if you divide that by three, you know, 13,000 a house. Now, mm -hmm. what are you what are you looking to uh, that first deal you get? Are you getting rent to own? Or are you doing uh, she going to pay you out cash? She's going to pay out cash because she's getting a lawsuit. Um, and so she's gonna have cash, so that one won't be sold for 35. Yeah, I wish I had you know that that, that thing, <laughs> I had that sound or something like that. <laughs> hold up, hold up, Roberta, hold on. Yeah, you they did. said nice, Roberta. Yes, 35,000. So, listen, you talking about. So do 18. So look, okay, I, I got to break it all the way she down. Got, she got her money back like instantly right, right there. I got to break it all the way down for the people. So, so 13, let's say that house is at 13,333, right? Mm -hmm. So so pretty much, you said 35,000? 35, yeah, 35. So this profit, we are talking about a profit of 21,667 dollars. Mm -hmm. And you said November 30th, right? Yeah, November 30th. Yeah. 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 You see Makia from class, like, <laughs> and again, you and you just started with Mobile Home Elite the first week in October, right? Yes, I started October 5th in that class. Uh -huh. yep. mm -hmm. I love it. I, I just need the people to understand what we're doing here over at Mobile Home Elite Investors. <laughs> so not only you want to get 35000 which you'll still be you know, five thousand. You got two more houses to sell, mm -hmm. and you can choose. Even if you have to sell a house each for five thousand each, you'll still profit. It didn't. Correct. Oh my goodness. Correct. Correct. Yep. Correct. So my biggest mobile home, I'm looking at listing that one between forty five and fifty, um, because it's about eighteen hundred square feet. It's a huge, oh, huge. It's a huge mobile home. It's a four bedroom, two bath, double wide. Um, and so, yeah, and then my, I have a 1,100 square feet, a 1,300 square feet, and an 1,800 square feet. Um, so my 1,300 will be about 40, 40, 45, somewhere in there. So, wow. Yeah. So you're so talking I, about making almost an $85,000 profit. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Hey, we we hey, it's, we honestly could just end this right now. Okay. <laughs> they, said, uh, they said big Roberta. Okay, <laughs> they were like talk to me nice. Okay, big Roberta, say my name correctly. <laughs> it's hilarious, hilarious. Hey, listen, wow, yes. we that told y'all if y'all came from Instagram, we told y'all y'all this is the one y'all needed to be on, and she just came talk big big boss talk. Because for one, hey, it's an interview over. <laughs> I love it. That is amazing. Oh my goodness, hey, Robert. And the thing I'm gonna tell y'all, sometimes you gotta go against the grain. Mm -hmm. Yeah, think about it. Nicole, us, we were just like, I don't know how she gonna like, do that. Hell one, right? No, no, don't need to do that. Yeah, that's gonna be too much. But you had the vision, mm -hmm. and you were like, you know what? I'm the about to take and the plan. This trash, and I'm about to turn this into a treasure. Right, right. Mm -hmm. wow. Yes, absolutely. So, um, I guess I was just eager. Again, for those that do know me, know I've met Nicole several times prior to mm -hmm. actually starting the class, um, and I told her, "You'll remember me. You you gonna know my name because everybody knows Nicole. Not good with names." <laughs> so, I was like, "You gonna remember me? You're you're gonna remember me." And honestly. I met her earlier this year. Um, 
and I wasn't ready. And mm -hmm. when I finally decided to join the class, I made it that I was ready. Mm -hmm. And coming ready, I'm like, let, let's go. I was already, I was out talking to park manager. She was like, you have not already did the homework. I haven't assigned it. And I was like, well, listen, I told you, I'm, what, what do we need to do? I'm on the way. Right. 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 I love it. <laughs> Man, so yeah, listen, it, it, I mean, it, it's amazing. Right. And, you know, somebody had asked real quick, uh, they asked about, you know, did you did, well, pretty much did you take a rehab loan or it was you just pretty much your cash? Mm -hmm. That's my own capital. Yeah. Your own capital, y'all. That is what is called investing in yourself. Yes. She invested in a program, got mentor, got everything into then. Right went ahead and turned around and took her own money and invested it, took a chance, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. And what I love about it was, Roberta, on paper, your, your, your investment looked like a big risk. <laughs> <laughs> but you got a big reward from yeah. that. You got right. a big reward coming. So, man, I, I mean, sh man, shout out, man. I, I love it. I love it. Now, yeah. didn't, didn't you just drop some more good news, Roberta? What, Byron? What you talking about? We <laughs> <laughs> said something in the group early. I was like, Roberta got all the strategies. I love it. I'm like, we, we keep that strategy in the bag. But I said you put it in the group. You want to talk about that? Or it's okay if you don't want to. But um, what the one I posted earlier today? Or yeah. okay. Yeah. Um, so out talking to people, um, I met another mobile home investor. Um, and he's like, can you sell my house? Uh-huh, for a fee, sure will. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what I'm doing now. Um, the same thing with the park owner. He plans to buy 10 brand new mobile homes over the next three years. Um, and he wants me to sell all of those for him too, because that's kind of the relationship that we've built with me being in the park and things like that. Um, and so every time if he evicts somebody or something comes up, somebody's looking to sell, he's like, call Roberta. Hey, Roberta, what you feel? What you think? Let me know and just kind of go from there. So hence the reason I was walking in the park yesterday <laughs> with my boot on. <laughs> he had three more that he was trying to, uh, he evicted some more people. So, yeah. I love it. Wow. So let's talk about that relationship. Really mm -hmm. fast, I love how you talked about you built a relationship with the park manager. Now he has 10 more mobile homes. You just was in the park yesterday. He was showing you three more other mobile homes that he wants you to be the go-to person to yeah. help sell those mobile homes. So just talk about how it's important to really build the relationships with someone like the park manager and even like having a reliable handyman on your team. Um. Yeah. <laughs> yes. So when I first talked to him, he was a total. Yeah. <laughs> Total. Literally the whole time while I'm talking, he's like texting. Mm -hmm. So I was like, it's okay. I have a bigger one. So we'll play that game if you want to. Um, <laughs> and I didn't follow back up or anything like that. And I understood. He was kind of like, I have people that come in and they say they want to do this and do that. And they never follow through or, you know, it's all talk and no show. So in my head, I was like, okay, you probably looking like she's the same. She going to do this, whatever. Um, so I let him marinate on what my words to him was. And then he finally called and was like, Hey, haven't seen you in a couple days because I literally was walking the park with contractors, getting estimates and just beating the streets every day. I talked to somebody on the phone. It was like, what you doing? I'm like, I'm out here beating these streets, <laughs> you know? <laughs> so, um, I was out there and he saw me being out there. Um, and to the fact that he reached back out to me. And was like, hey, haven't seen you, you know, have you kind of thought about which ones you want to purchase, kind of where you're at and things like that. Um, and I was like, oh, OK, well, I'll let you know, you know, still kind of waiting on the approval from Nicole, <laughs> um, just still kind of <laughs> dragging along. But he reached back out again, you know, hey, still, you know, just want to let you know um, I do have some other investors looking. OK, OK, that's fine. Mm -hmm. um, and then finally. I was like, hey, OK, this is what I want to do. And now he's just like, hey, Roberta, 
the guys, they're looking good. I see you walk <laughs> around. Your handyman asked me to do this. So, you know, we got electric going too. <laughs> yes, I love it. So he was making sure the pole and the meter and things like that were up. But he's more than willing to help if they need anything. He's like, I'll climb under and turn the water on. It's okay. And, wow. you know, that kind of stuff like that, too. So it has definitely worked out. Um just kind of being in the forefront, I'm more of a show than tell person. Mm-hmm. Um, and when he was this, the whole conversation, I was like, okay, I'm gonna show you. I just have to show you. I don't have to say anything. I'll show you. And that's why I did. And so that's kind of where we're at now to mm-hmm. he, um, I had surgery on Friday and he's texting me like, Hey, you got a chance to come out? And I was like, no, I just had surgery. So he's like, oh, okay. And then he texted the next day and was like, how are you feeling? You feeling better? And, you know, I got some more. And I was like, oh, look at you. <laughs> <laughs> Can't make sure I'm all right, you know. Okay, and, look, I'm trying to be your bestie. <laughs> right, right. You want to get homes up out of this park, but it's okay. <laughs> so. I love it. That's amazing. Yeah, and I wanted to ask you that because People always ask us, all of our students, like, how are you guys so successful? And it's always been relationships. Without mm-hmm. the relationships that we have built us, even you, Roberta, talking about the relationship you built with that park manager, look at all of the opportunity you have coming up in 2022. Right. Right. Like, I'm so proud. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, it has. One of the other investors that's in that park, um, he has another one and he was like, oh, he hasn't been working on it. You should ask him about it. Mm -hmm. So I actually met that investor and now we are like, what you got? What you doing? What about that? What about this? What about that? And so Mm -hmm. Byron, he knows the park owner. Mm. Exactly. I just found out today. So I was like, send me his phone number. Right. 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 So I was like, send me the phone number just so because I've been talking more so to him and the son. Mm-hmm. But the son does most of the talking. Um, and so he was like, no, no, like I, I know him. I've done work at his part. Hey. Right. You want to meet for lunch tomorrow? Right. <laughs> so, um, yes, yeah, just the whole networking, having those conversations, and just kind of building friends, not enemies. Um, we're all out here to do something and just kind of going from there. How can I help you and vice versa? That's kind of how I look at it. Gems, gems. I mean, Man, that's so dope. And again, I think everybody, again, if you're in the comments, y'all, y'all got to keep on dropping them fire signs for Roberta, man, because she blazed this from the gates, right? And, you know, I, I love what like you said when Sharnice even asked you about the questions about relationships, right? And, you know, one thing you said, you said, you know, you're not you're not out here trying to, you know, create like enemies and you, you're not out here trying to get into with people, right? You pretty much, hey, you know, playing a position, going in here. But what I love about it is, you're allowing your work to show for you, right? Yeah. You, you're not in here saying, because what happens is, I'm going to be honest, sometimes investors, we go in there and we try to overpromise, like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? We, yeah, I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm, and then you don't even got the resources yet to do it, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. And so, you know, what you, I love how you said you took that as motivation, like, you know, okay, I see you doing all this. I'm going to show you, sir. Right, right. And and I, I did. It was it was honestly when I walked out, I was just like, Oh, he was a, yeah. a person, but you know, it's okay. And so and I could take it as he's probably been burned, he's probably right. heard that he did have um a unit that an investor had started, but oh got overwhelmed and stopped and things like that. So I get it, it happens, it happens even in single family, just in regular real estate. Mm-hmm. Um it even happens too, but I didn't honestly promise anything. I was like, listen, you have a lot of homes that need to be rehabbed. You also have some vacant lots. And, you know, I'm looking to help build that so you can get your lot rent. I can get these sold, provide some family um, home. Affordable housing is something that's super important right now, um, especially since interest rates are starting to climb a little bit. But um, I feel like we all deserve a second chance. We all have had a pass. Um, and you don't always have to shoot for the moon. You shoot for your moon at whatever level that may be. 
um, and just kind of continue to go from there. But we all deserve to have that safe place um, that we can call home and own and whatever the case may be that you want to do with it. So and I want to kind of be able to help provide that for people. So nah, that's so dope. I love it. I love, I love it. it. Seeing you drop some gems. Oh man, we got a shout out Daphne, one of your classmates. She said, I'm late, but I'm late. <laughs> yeah, you got your classmates in here deep. You know yes, they mean? came to support because E5, we stick together. Oh, we are, I love it. we I still love are it. talking all the time. We still trying to have meetings and keep each other um, uplifted, supported. If there's anything that somebody's going through a deal, they got questions, we are sharing information back and forth, whatever we can do to just make sure we all succeed in this that and hold each other accountable too. we we making sure of that but you also know uh nicole is still <laughs> cracking oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> dropping that making sure y'all doing what y'all need to do even after class is over right? yes yes yeah, yes leslie. okay we got leslie in the house okay yes okay. <laughs> leslie oh, called one of my leslie called one of mine the sun room so <laughs> <laughs> Uh, that's who called it the sunroom. That's we called it the sunroom. So she was like, Roberta turned that sunroom into money. I was like, listen, you better leave my sunroom alone. So that's our little E5 joke. Yeah, I love it. Who's on Facebook? Because I see somebody says, said, Roberta represented heavy for E5. Because for some reason, Facebook don't want to uh, be playing us. And I, I'm going to answer this question real quick, Roberta. If you actually... You want to take a shot at this? Because again, you 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 know you you like a you a rookie and a vet right now. <laughs> it says, why would somebody sell so low when they can fix it up and sell at a higher rate? Um, because it's being able to make it attainable. Mm -hmm. Um, I don't want to oversell. Um, I want you to be able to have the joy of home ownership. So I want it to be attainable. I want you to be able to reach it. Um, and so for me, it's not about so much of the quantity, but more of the quality of what I provide. Um, and so in that, if I could flip 10 mobile homes, 10 people have a home and I make 200 grand, 100 grand, whatever the case may be, that's fine. Um, but it's more of making sure they have the quality home than the quantity of the home. Yeah, nice. I love it. And then one thing, uh, Madeline. You know, I want you to think about this. This is a perfect example I can give you, right? Two things. It's either A, I can go to the grocery store and I can go buy a steak and I can go home and cook it and get the finished results. Or I can go to a steakhouse and they prepare it for me and then I get it served to me in about, you know, 15, 20 minutes, right? Mm -hmm. And so I'm going to pay a premium price for it to be served to me hot on the plate to be taken out and be cooked just like how they said it's going to be cooked, right? Mm -hmm. So what happens is most people don't want to actually, they don't they don't want to go to the grocery store and make the steak themselves. Mm -hmm. Same thing with real estate. Most people don't want to do the work themselves. They don't want to go and try to, you know, do all this. They think it's complicated. They'd rather get the finished product. Mm -hmm. So the reason why what happens is the higher rate is the value, right? right. The reason why you go buy the steak from the grocery store for a fraction of the cost of what it costs is because of the value because the value is it's made for you it's prepared for you all right same thing with a home right the value is roberta's putting the value in the home so mm -hmm. now she could command her price and that's how that's how that really works so i want you to remember that that's the best example i can give you mm -hmm. yeah man i love it i love <laughs> it man Let's see. Um, oh man, I love it. Say, team. Uh, Lara says, team teamwork makes the dream work. So okay. let me ask you this, right? I love it because one thing I'm gonna tell you, Roberta, was on the bus. I, I challenge y'all. I gave y'all a challenge. I gave y'all a challenge, and it looks like that you about to meet your challenge. Let me let me ask you this. You think you may be you may be able to get two of them in? Oh yeah. I love yeah. it. All three of them is my goal. All three is my goal. And honest, yeah, honestly, so my goal for myself is to have six by the 30, December 31st. So, but that's just something that I kind of, again, coming in with that game plan and kind of knowing what I want to do and what to do. And you guys providing the tools and the information that I wasn't aware of and, you know, just kind of that go-to knowledge and things like that so that I can 
achieve that. So, but I, six families, that's where I'm at. So. I love it. I love it. That's amazing. And so, you know, if you, you can actually tell them what was the challenge that I gave y'all before the end of the year? Um, so we had to help a family by the end of the year. Um, so help a family, get them in the home for the holidays, end of the holidays, start 2022 off, right? But make sure you get somebody in the home by the end of the year. So that's what we're striving to. That's what we're striving to. <laughs> I love it, man. And that honestly, you know, again, that, that's that's what it's all about. You know, just ha- helping that family with that affordable housing and Again, you got to help three families. Mm-hmm. Like, like when you you sit there and just kind of just take a second and think about it, you got to help three families have affordable housing. And I'm gonna ask you if you know off the top, like, do you know, like, you know, a range of like what the average uh, single family house is selling for in that area? Um, <clears throat> one hundred five, one hundred five to one ninety nine, something like that. Wow. wow. 105 yeah. to 199. Mm-hmm. And you're talking about giving people houses for 35,000, 40, was it 45,000? 45, and 50. And, 50, and the $50,000 house is honestly bigger than some of the $100,000 houses. So my biggest house is 1,800 square feet, whereas a $100,000 house is a 3 1, 1,200 square feet. Um, so to me, I'm just like, that's even better, you know? So that's, that's a whole lot better. If you, whatever it is that you do, that should be something that hopefully you'll be able to obtain and have for yourself. And you don't have to go through all of the bank financing and all of those kind of red tape hurdles and things like that, that you do get when you're going through bank financing. So, yeah. Man, I love we got Miss Sheree checking in. She, that's the best feeling when you help a family become a homeowner. Absolutely. Yes. Absolutely. 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 That's, Absolutely. That's the addicting part about mobile home investing. You know, it ain't the money. I tell you, the money is secondary. Yeah. The addicting part is when you start helping people, you're like, man, are we really making a difference out here? And then before you know it, you're looking at your pockets like, man, okay, well, <laughs> we're making a big change right now. <laughs> right, right, right. So, but it's worth it It, it, at the end of the day. um, I mean, like you said at the dinner, it's more of finding your why. um, And just if your why is money, you'll always be running. Um, But kind of looking at your why for other reasons, um, just so that you can kind of know where you want to go, set your standards, set your plan and do what you need to do to achieve it. So, but that's the, that's the main part. So you can call ahead and get started. It's honestly not hard. You can get started. (laughs) Rehab, construction, all of that stuff like that. Um, Totally different. But, you know, (laughs) taking a program, getting your notes, doing the assignments, all of that stuff. That's the easy part, you know. Um, But getting out here is honestly probably the hardest part. Like I said, I met Nicole in April. Here it is. Six, seven months later, I'm just like, all right, I'm ready. You know, so you, you have to start when you're ready um, so that you can be successful. I know a lot of times, you know, we'll kind of do stuff and push it under the rug because we get so inundated yeah. with our normal day to day life and things like that. Um, that when you decide you're ready, you're ready, you know. Mm-hmm. So I was thinking, I'm ready. I love it. So let me ask you this, Roberta. Let's let's talk about the fast track program, right? Sure. So, yes. Let's talk about. So tell the people what your journey was like going through the fast track, going through with Coach Nicole, coming to the bus tour, and what that program has done for your mobile home investing journey. Um. So I joined the live, talked to Nicole again, um, and decided to go ahead and do it. The information that you get is not something like I Googled a lot. I think we all Google. Google is everybody. You know? right, Google's best friend. Yes. Yes. Google is Google University is for everybody. Mm-hmm. Um, and for the longest, I was just like, I can do it. I can do it. You know, um, but to be able to take the class and there are some things that you don't know that you didn't find on Google um, and 
those gems that she gave and you guys gave and um, just that help and accountability and, you know, pushing and Nicole wants to see you succeed. And that's a great thing because it's good to have somebody that believe in you when you don't believe in you. Mm -hmm. um, but just the information that you get was, it was great. It was great. And building a bond with your class, um, a great thing too, because we all, talk to each other. Hey, what you doing? What you got? What about this? What about that? And so forth. But going on the bus tour kind of made it real. The bus mm -hmm. tour, you're out there, you're walking, you're seeing it. Yes, we do it ourselves throughout, but to be able to be with your coaches and Byron and Charnice and out there, this is this, this is that, this is this, and meeting other people um, that are doing it, It's it just makes it it kind of comes full circle per se, um, just so you're able to kind of confirm the information that you've been given and see it for yourself and be able to like, oh, you you exist. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so so it, it helps a lot because like I said, I Googled a lot, but to be able to have the people already go through it and say, you know, I made this mistake. Don't do this. I made this mm -hmm. mistake. Don't do this. <laughs> you know, mm -hmm. this is this and this is that. That it, 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 it helps. It helps a lot. A lot. Mm -hmm. I love it. Man, I'm so happy that y'all, you know, I kept, remember I kept on asking y'all, like, what can we make better? What can we change? Because we want y'all to get the ultimate experience. And, you know, I, I'm just happy that, you know, that you not only you invest in yourself, but you apply the information. Yes. And that was a big difference, right? A lot of times, I'm going to be honest with you guys, you know, we have the information, we have it, but when you apply yourself, it's a game changer. Mm -hmm. It's a game changer. So with that said, we're going to hold that because, again, I'm so happy that, you know, again, just to see your journey, what you've created. You're talking about you about to be a six-figure earner very fast. Right. Business, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, no, you're good. So, yeah, you got to be a six figure earner very fast in this business. And that's what this program is about to teach you how to become a six figure earner. And you just took, you just, you got on a rocket ship. You don't want to eat our must. <laughs> and you going straight to the moon. Right. You know? right. Right. Catch me at seven. Right. Right. I love it. Right, right. And so, man, so like with that being said, you know, again, we, we always got to bless the people. Most people, y'all know, is we always had some crazy sale. Now, the Elite Fast Track program, that's something that you're interested in and you want and you want the hands-on experience just like Roberta received, right? We have our Elite Fast Track program, which is, uh, the cost is $9,997. Oh, sorry, $9,997. But, guess what? Y'all know what time of the year it is. It's Black Friday, y'all. It's Black Friday. So we got a special, very <laughs> special question. I know, Roberta, I know all y'all like, oh, what the hell? Right. Hey, that's the way. It was crazy, Roberta, is that if y'all was on our webinar last night, if you was on a webinar with Nicole last night, you know we gave an even additional discount on our Black Friday sale because... <laughs> It's that time of the year, and Byron right. and I, we want to see a thousand people in this program by this time next year. But not only a thousand people, we want to see a thousand six-figure earners, and we want our thousand students to put a thousand families in mobile homes, right? Yeah, right. And you see, again, Tamika already, she's in the Fast Track currently right now, Fast Track 6. She said she made $600 just from the Facebook group, right? Yes, Tamika. <laughs> yes. <laughs> hey, right. Tila said, don't wait on the sideline, take advantage. I went ahead and dropped the link. Um, and again, make sure you take advantage. Um, again, 50% off, right? Uh, for $49.97. You're talking about hands-on training. What all comes in the fast track? You have you have a five-week master class with Nicole Briscoe, right? A six-figure earner, going on a seven-figure earner, right? You get to uh, come out to the bus tour. The bus tour alone is a $2,000 weekend, but you get to come. That's included in that. You get lifetime access, right, for the alumni. So you get to meet the Robertas in class once, you know, once a month. The Aarons, the Cherise, the Keelans. I mean, literally everybody that you all will see. All right, speaking of Aaron, he just showed some love. Hey, all right, Aaron. Speaking... What's Sorry, up, That's the wrong link, too. <laughs> oh, my bad. Yeah. Wait. 
Which one? Not this not. Oh, okay. This one? Yeah. Oh, my bad, y'all. So not that link. <laughs> this link. Uh, yeah, that's the right link. My bad, y'all. I don't know. It, it was on it. The full price or something? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, All right. So you want to click that link to take advantage. And the discount is already it's automatically applied. So it was no code. So I want to make sure y'all tapping in. But again, look. Don't come holler at us in December because this is only for Black Friday. We're only doing this until after Thanksgiving. After that, it's back at $9,997. So again, we only doing this discount for a limited amount of time. And the reason why is because we want all of you guys to be able to take advantage of this program that we are putting on for you guys. Yes. And if you here's the thing, click the link. We even have a is that going to be this and we even have a free training. So everybody on here, that's a gift for y'all. Watch the free training. Um, if you lease and then get on the phone with one of our strategy coaches. All right, okay, we got Ravella in the house. Hey, hey y'all, yes, E5, my E5 love. E5. <laughs> so if you want to get on the phone with our strategy coach, then that's elitefasttrack.com. So I'm gonna have Byron put it up there. So again, we have payment plans. We have financial aid options. We have so many different options for you to go ahead and take advantage of this program. Yeah, so it's yeah. in the chat. You may definitely want to click that link, uh, take full advantage of it. Again, Black Friday, this is the only time that it's going to ever be this price. All right, 49 Not even on this next year. <laughs> never, this program will never be this price again. I can tell you that. Roberta, let me ask you this. Sure. Everybody who are here watching and they in, in the fast track program and they got this price forty nine ninety seven. What do you got to say to them? Listen, all of us are probably like, can we start over? <laughs> <laughs> who said that yesterday? On the right. Can we start over? I should have waited. You done it. <laughs> I know. They're like, you should wait. And I'm like, no, 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 because you already making money back tenfold, so you good. You ahead of the game. Yes. So, yes. yes. So, but I mean, it's worth it again. Like you said earlier, Byron, um, being able to invest in yourself, that kind of makes you say, listen, I just spent this money. Let me let me get out here and get it. Let me get out and do it. So you, you do have to invest in yourself. So yeah. the best thing you can go ahead and do, get out, learn the gyms, talk to the alumni, talk to your classmates, um, Nicole, just being able to be in the community to talk to people who are like minded to continue to help you and uplift you and support you. That's the best thing that you could do. And it really is. No, that's, yeah. that's so true. I'm going to let you answer this question. It says, I'm a trucker. Can I, can I drive and do this? You sure can. Pull over at that truck stop, search you some homes. While you're driving, you see that mobile home park along the highway, pull hey. that rig over in there. And be like, hey, how you doing? Right. Let's hang over in that truck stop and go on to that mobile home. Right, you go right on over there. The yeah. <laughs> the driveway big enough, pull that rig in there too and go in there and talk to that park manager and see what you can come up with and things like that. So, but absolutely, you sure can. So you yeah. really can. I'm gonna get so just make sure you find your good team and um, somebody to be able to be there and do whatever it is that you need to do if you are on the road at that time. Yeah. Yeah. So Madeline, you asked, do we have stats on how many black people reside in mobile homes? So I'll be honest, I haven't, I haven't seen anything particular that has the demographics. <laughs> this is very a... I call it prehistoric industry where the stats and things, you know, as far as stats that they provide, you know, 22 million Americans live in mobile homes, um, mm -hmm. you know, it, it, but it doesn't necessarily break down the demographics of, um, of race, right? Age group, we get age groups and things. So, it, I mean, it really tells you, I think that's all about a, you know, a actual location of mm -hmm. where that is. But at the end of the day, listen, money is green. And we helping people get affordable housing. That's all that matters. And everybody need a place to stay. I don't care what color you are. That's what I'm saying. I don't care, I don't care what, race you, what race you get. Everybody need a place to stay. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes nah. So listen, y'all. I want y'all to follow Roberta on her journey on Instagram at Harris Investments. All right. Make sure y'all follow the queen. Show the queen some love in the comments. All right. Because, man, I'm telling y'all, she killed this interview y'all unrehearsed what i love about it i see your question opal said is the price correct yes the yes. price is correct when you click the checkout page 
is going to be, I think it's like a dollar more for the fee, but yeah, you're good to go. You'll see the 50% off once you get to the checkout page. <laughs> yeah, I'll drop the link one more time in it. Um, so see. yes, come on, Opal. You on the shot too. So come yeah, on. Yeah, right, right. You right. You, you right here with us. Come on, join the family. Man, listen, y'all. This this is this is a super okay, good one. look, you better listen. Up. Put 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 Tavia. Tavia, right. Because she know, like I said, yeah. this program will never be this price again. So don't yeah, think right. J, I mean November 2022. Like I'm just gonna wait till next year because I know oh uh, no. <laughs> Black Friday, you're going to be like, damn, that's the Black Friday sale? <laughs> yes. Because you are creating six-figure earners in this program. You get your money back tenfold on your first deal. It's a no-brainer. Yeah, yeah, man, they're gonna be like two dollars off. What's like a <laughs> but she said it perfectly. Yesterday's price is not today's price, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Hey man, I love it, man. Like Shamika said, for real, from everybody, congratulations. <laughs> with the, you know, I mean, that's what she said. Watch out though. I know you oh, see that, right, E5. Right, all right, to yeah. all right, Tamika. <laughs> but look, we set the bar, so y'all better bring it. <laughs> So bring it, yeah. yes. I love it. Man, I love it. Yes, all that game you get for it. She said she's hey y'all. Right, it is. It is. It, it's a wealth it's a of knowledge. So talked about even after you're in the program, you oh, got yeah. the alumni network. Oh yeah. So this yeah. is a lifetime program. We do monthly alumni calls where we do check-ins every other month, and then every other month in between that we do actual classes we got some experts business credit funding park owners land. like i ain't gonna say too much because yeah. you gotta be in the program <laughs> to know what we giving you mm -hmm. to know what we giving everybody but still it's a no-brainer program uh, the family right. man we this is a family over here you know that's that's what i love about it and you know i mean that's that's what we're gonna continue building we're gonna continue building a family all right and um yeah, it's real love over here. It's real love on this side. That's what I like about it, man. I know. Uh, oh, it. hold on. Oh, Nicole, we about to hop off. Uh -oh. <laughs> hold on. We got look like oh. we look, we didn't we didn't pop, we didn't got it. Hey, like two minutes. Okay, Nicole. well, well, good night. Good night. Oh, no ma'am, no ma'am. Look, hey, look, hey, hey no. look, look, it's Nicole. Look, we were just telling them about all the great stuff that they get, but it's no brainer price that we offer. Listen. <laughs> I'm not gonna tell y'all how many Voxer messages I got last night. They was like, "Damn, that's a good deal." I should have signed up later. I'm like, "Bro, you don't already closed three deals. You, <laughs> you, got, you your already money got your money back tenfold. You back. What are we doing?" Yeah, yeah. But what else I missed? Man, hey, you just how oh, dope ass interview. interview. That's what you did. Killed this interview. This but did, like did she tell y'all about them other houses she about to buy? Was that in the 10? Was, was, was that, that in the 10? And that's something new. You told us about the three, and you told us about the one where you sell it with the tenant for the other investors. <laughs> It's all yeah. So I said, <laughs> look, look at her stuttering. Look at her stuttering. I always want to say that on the line. Look, you're like, you're there. Go ahead. You got to say it now, Roberta. Go ahead. I know because Nicole always be like, oh, did you tell him about? And I'm like, no, Nicole, I ain't said nothing. <laughs> so, but no, like, again, I told you that he had asked me to come out. So I went and looked at some more. So I didn't went ahead and made an offer on the other three. <laughs> So to go ahead and get those done, that's why I was like, you know, at least by the end of the year, I want to be able to close them six and have my six families in. And, and y'all already know what Byron know, Nicole know. Sharnice, you knew about um, going through with the park too. So yeah, that's wow. what I'm Byron, Byron made one statement at the dinner table. He said, I want you all to commit to helping one family by the end of this year. Mm -hmm. One family by the end of this year and everybody flew their hand up. Roberta said, I'm going to do more than that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This yeah. girl will have almost, I think, like 10 houses done before December. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If understood the assignment had a face, it would be her. And yeah. I don't know if she told y'all this. Y'all do know this girl got a a a, a, a six month old baby, <laughs> <laughs> a six month old baby, now, and I think a teenager. He, he eleven. My son eleven. A yeah. preteen. 
Right. And just had surgery on her foot. Yeah, so just at the mobile home park. I was at the park yesterday. Crutches and everything. Right. Crutches <laughs> and everything, girl. We didn't broke down Roberta's numbers. We didn't got the calculator out on this live. Look, Roberta gonna be a six figure earner by January. Well, like Period. I said, good night, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, listen. The hey. interview was over when she broke the numbers down. Probably in, in the first twelve minutes. All right, well, y'all go ahead and end this shit so I can rewatch the replay. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, listen, y'all. Uh, look, go ahead, drop that link. I'm gonna have Byron drop the link one more time again. You want to take advantage? of our black friday sale because i'm telling y'all this will never be this price ever again <laughs> never I'm ever, ever. You, i'm telling you we we didn't eat mm, I'm a, I'm a, i am ain't gonna get on the soapbox am i gonna get on the soapbox you going you're trying to get off nicole so you ain't gonna get right, on the soapbox I'm, you're trying to get out you ain't gonna get on the soapbox listen y'all it just comes a time where you just gotta just stop and invest in yourself the mm -hmm. end YouTube only gonna teach you so much, but to have a god dog on mentorship that is never ending. Y'all remember that song that got stuck in our head? This is a song that never ends. Mm -hmm. This is a mentorship that never ends. It goes on and on, my friends. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like it, it don't stop. Like once you once you get to a certain level, like yeah, Roberta doing good. She about to kill these ten houses, but she on the list, right? Right. Mm -hmm. We got to teach her now. In the next couple of months, okay. You done got all of this money from these deals. It's time to start investing on lands. Mm -hmm. Well, wait a minute. I don't want to use all my cash, Nicole. What should I do? No problem. Next month we got somebody to come in and talk about business credit. Mm -hmm. No, she not paying no more fees to us. She that mm -hmm. one time lifetime membership, y'all. Yeah. Five thousand dollars, and it's normally ten thousand dollars. Yeah, here's the season to stop inboxing me asking a thousand questions. <laughs> right, right, yeah, yeah. that's fast. That's that's you that's get fast. your money, you do get your money back. But again, as we said earlier, you have to invest in yourself, but make sure mm -hmm. that it's something that you're ready to do yeah. because you're going to be held accountable and you need to succeed. So yeah. if you're going to spend the money, you're going to succeed, you, but you have yeah. to. The much as the corporate world, oh, you're a great employee. Well, guess what? You could be a great boss too. So Ooh, talk that talk. I love it. Look, I think let's go ahead and end it on that. <laughs> Roberta, we're gonna prepare you too. They about to be DMing you too. Like, hey Roberta, can you teach me? Can you teach me? I know I don't have a five, but you know, I, I give you I give you two hundred dollars and can I get on the phone with you? It's coming. I'm gonna let you know. I'm gonna send them to Nicole DM. I'm like, listen. <laughs> We'll send them to my DM. I get so many people say, I see you charge $300 for 30 minutes. But do you mind if I give you $50 for... <laughs> oh, they trying to really negotiate. Hey. I, love hey, hey. I don't think people realize when they say stuff like that. Y'all remember that movie with Chris Rock and he was like, well, how much is it for one reel? <laughs> I don't have time for that. And it's not to be funny, but my time is with my with my students, y'all. Mm -hmm. They take up a lot of it, and I gotta be there for them. I don't have time, and it's not just one person. It's not. Mm -hmm. It's not just one. It's several people. Like, well, let me just talk for a few minutes. I promise you, I can get everything in. You're not. I can't teach you mobile home investing in a ten minute, fifteen minute conversation. Is not right. gonna happen. It's not. right. Mm -hmm. That that consultation fee is somebody maybe who went through a mentorship or a program or well, i should say mentorship but a program and they just want to talk right i make this deal this is what i'm about to do help me help me do this right mm -hmm. anyway wow. i'm done i digress it works it, it, it's worth it you know to be able to because i listen how many messages did i send you today <laughs> like just going back and forth and hey should I cross my T, dot my I, doing all of that kind of stuff? So just being able to be held accountable and having the access to be able to succeed is mm -hmm. you ready, right. spend the money, do what you got to do, and, you know, just kind of go from there. I love it, man. Mm -hmm. Ladies, if you want here, some of y'all got Gucci purses in the, that y'all done paid or Gucci outfit that costs more than that. Mm. Y'all could have bought a trailer and flipped it. Hey, listen, <laughs> or, 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 you done, or you done bought a car. They give you all these problems that you paid five thousand for, and the car ain't making you no money. You can't tour it. 
they can't drive to the park with it. <laughs> right. Just saying. But Damn, nah, they, used, they used to be me. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm -mm. Hey, I, hey, man, I feel But now, listen, y'all, y'all been phenomenal. Roberta, thank you. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Thank, thank you all so much. much. Thank oh, you. Man. Looking forward to hearing your journey. Cannot wait till you hit the over cross over that six figure mark. Keep on doing it. And again, y'all want to hit something dope? Roberta, only two months old is in this industry. <laughs> I'm one month, Byron. I'm six one weeks. Month? Oh, I'm six weeks. Right. Six, oh, she going on. Right. She going on. I'm talking to November. I'm only six weeks. One <laughs> month old. Nicole is about to be two years old. We are turning four. You got to ask yourself. Yep. Yep. What you want to do is wide open, y'all. You better get on now. You better get in while to get in. <laughs> right. Especially why it's 5,000. Go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. Oh, man. Yeah, for it. real. All right, y'all. Well, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. Thank y'all so much. Everybody, make sure y'all subscribe to our YouTube channel. Make sure y'all hit that like button. If you're on Facebook, make sure you follow the page. Make sure you uh, hit that like button as well. Share and When this is over, make sure you share this with at least 10 people. People need to see this. People need to see how Roberta was able to change her life. And is, and trust me, y'all, this is not the last time y'all going to see Roberta. And uh, make sure y'all follow Nicole. Let me go ahead and throw this up here. If y'all want to follow uh, Roberta's journey, make sure y'all follow Roberta on Instagram at Harris Investments. All right. Make sure you follow us on Instagram at Mobile Home Elite Investors. And then make sure y'all follow Nicole on Instagram at mobile home underscore mommy on instagram y'all y'all been phenomenal y'all know god bless have a good one bye, bye.